Hello, and welcome to another indie horror game. This time, I'll be playing a game called Dollhouse, and if you'd like to do the same, you'll find the links and the details down below in the description for you, okay? Now, in this game, I'm going to get woken up in the middle of the night by my friend who has a wild and wacky idea. He wants me to drive out into the middle of nowhere, in the middle of a forest, in the middle of the night, to explore an abandoned house with him. So, of course, I'm going to say yes. I'm going to say, yeah, that sounds like a great idea. I can't think of a better way to spend my evening. That sounds like a fantastic way to die a slow and painful death. Okay, probably not that last bit, but you get the gist. This is Dollhouse, and I really hope you enjoy it. Let's begin. Who wakes me up in the middle of the night? Only your friend with the best ideas, of course. All right, here we go. Got the controls on the left there. They look fairly basic. E to interact, control to crouch, shift to run. All right, I think it was my PC that just woke me up, so let's take a look. Right, Mark, that's the name of my friend that's gonna get me killed, is it? Right, so he writes, hey, I found an abandoned house in the woods. It's a bit smelly, but I'm sure it's not much fun either way. It's not really selling it to me, to be honest, but uh, a few minutes later he writes, Let's come check it out. There might still be some valuables inside. He wants to burglarize the place. Now it makes sense. I'll send my coordinates when I'm inside. Also, bring your own flashlight. Okay. Will do, Mark. Will do. Just need to find the bugger, I suppose. Okay. Initial impressions are pretty good. This looks quite nice. Fairly realistic. But where on earth is my flashlight? Oh, oh no, it's a TV remote, isn't it? Hmm. Somewhere over here in one of the drawers. Oh, hang on. Well, there's something. It's a key. A key to open my apartment door. All right. Well, I was probably going to need that as well. What about these two? They don't work? No? Okay. Over here? Is it just the top drawers? Hmm. Yeah, it seems like it. Nothing in there. No flashlight. Uh, maybe somewhere in the kitchen. Let's see. Probably not. <laughs> Probably not in the fridge, but I can have a look. Yeah, maybe I should take a few swigs of this beer. Probably the last few swigs I can ever take. No. Uh, of course, there's no flashlight, so let's close this up and look elsewhere. Okay. All right. Got cutlery there. Yeah, it's just the top drawers, isn't it? Ah, there you go. My flashlight. The one I bought in case of an emergency. I don't think it's an emergency quite yet, but it probably will be. Okay. I'm looking around and I'm not seeing a battery meter. Let's hope it stays that way. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see. Through here. All right. Am I going to find anything useful down the toilet? No, I don't think so. In here? No. All right. Nothing in the bath. There's a sink back here. Maybe I should splash some water on my face. Get this bad idea out of my head. I should probably just go back to bed, shouldn't I? Right. Okay. Are we just getting out of here then? Uh, right. The key? I unlocked it. All right. Yep. Looks like we're good to go. Let's go and meet Mark. Oh boy. Getting bad vibes already. Hmm. Okay. This way it is. Maybe I should be knocking on my neighbor's door so they can come out and prevent me from making a really stupid decision. And yeah, this doesn't bode too well, does it? Here we go then. It's bloody dark, isn't it? And I'm driving too bloody fast! Slow down! Right, there you go. Ah, there's a car in front of me. Is that Mark's? All right, here we are. And I can't get back in and drive off. Shame. Nice. No sign of him. Or the house, for that matter. Yep, this is Mark's car. So where is he? Hmm. Like, genuinely, where is he? Where's the house? <laughs> Did he send me the wrong coordinates? I mean, his car's there, but... I don't know where I need to go. Oh, bloody hell. We parked a long, long way away, didn't we? And there's lights on. Okay, well, I guess... Hmm. 
Maybe him saying it was abandoned was just a ruse, just a cover. Maybe he wants to get me involved in criminal activity. Maybe he genuinely does want to burglarize the place. That's why he parked so far away. Re okay. Was that him? Did he just flick the light switch? Someone did. Bloody hell, it's a bit of a workout just to get here, isn't it? There you go, right. It's a big place, actually. Looked a lot smaller from further away, but, you know, that's perspective for you. Alright. Still no sign of the man. Inside? Oh, it's locked. Okay. Hmm, can't see much. I can see a staircase. But yeah, no Mark. Surely he'd be... Mark? That's you, isn't it? Hmm, hang on. Let's try the door again. Ah, oh, it's still locked. <sighs> okay. Um, I might have to break and enter here. Yeah. Don't know where he's gone. Can't sneak in through the window. Maybe there's going to be a... Ah, oh, I was going to say a door at the back, but maybe a, a door at the side? Let's try this one. Hey, there you go. Alright. And I can't leave. Wonderful. Just wonderful. Okay. Hmm. What happened to Mark? Why didn't he meet me? Am I going to find his corpse in here? Yeah, I don't think this place is abandoned. It's still pretty well furnished. Obviously, it could use some work. It's a work in progress, maybe, but yeah. I think my friend had some pretty nasty ideas. And there is the doll, right? That's why it's called Dollhouse. I can examine it. That's creepy. Yeah. yeah it is. It wasn't you running around that I heard inside, was it? Hmm. Okay, through here? No, that's locked from the other side, actually. Alright, the cupboards... Nah, the cupboards aren't gonna work, are they? I think it's just the drawers in this game. What about these, then? Okay. Yeah, just the top drawers, too. Oh. I shouldn't have left that door open. I should have shut it and locked it. I'd make a mistake. I hope I could go back to that time and see their smile once again. I hope. I don't think Mark wrote that, did he? Hmm. Okay. So, no opening those. Let's go this way, shall we? Right or left? Um, let's actually go right for once. Yeah. Alright, this isn't locked from the other side. What have we got here? There's a lot of floorboards missing. But, uh, yeah, still pretty well furnished. Looks like this was a, a reading room or a, a study or something like that. Nothing down there? No? Okay. Hmm. Alright. Who's this? The owner of the house? Was that the best photo they got of him? Oh boy. Right, let's go this way. Alright. Oh, no, no, it's not alright. That's gonna go down to the basement. I don't think I'm ready to die quite yet, so maybe let's just explore the rest of the kitchen first. What about these drawers? Yeah. Nothing? No? Okay. Oh, really? Even the top drawers are failing me now. Oh, dear. Okay, nothing on the table. Right, okay, this way. Uh, I can't use those. Uh, Alright. Still no sign of him. This is very, very strange. Can't use those either. No, okay. Oh, this is also locked from the other side. Hmm. I guess it's the basement then, isn't it? Of course it's the basement. Of course it is. <laughs> well, at least I haven't found his corpse yet, right? Whoa. That actually did make me freeze up a little bit there. That did make me jump. Whoa. 
Where the fuck did this come from? That wasn't there before, was it? Right, okay. Uh, yeah. Let's check the basement. Let's go check the basement. Oh, really? I don't suppose this is going to work, is it? No, it, it doesn't fit the lock, right. Okay, so we're looking for a basement key. Uh, I guess I missed it on the way. I don't like the look of this. Where's this going to take me? Towards the study area? Or to here? Maybe this is going to lead me to the key. Or oh, maybe not. Nothing in the bucket. Is there something in here? Hmm. I feel like I should re-explore again, open up the drawers, just in case. There might be something that's out of place, something that's a little bit different. I'm definitely looking for a basement key. I can't remove this. It's not hanging behind it. No, okay. Um, right, let's go back into that living room area, maybe. Oh, God. Right. Well, I couldn't use the door before, but now I'm definitely not getting out of there. Yeah, the door is blocked. Okay. Yeah, I didn't really check the mantelpiece before. Actually, can't get too close to it, though. Um, hmm. Oh, the doll. Of course, the doll has moved. Does the doll unlock this door? No, still locked from the other side, and you didn't leave me a key, did you? No. <sighs> Alright. Nothing down there in the box. The void of a box. Bloody hell, that looks bottomless. Okay, there's... <laughs> there's got to be something... back here. Right? So where does this go? Where does it stop? Right here? Uh, I don't see anything. Nothing in the plant pot? Hmm. Definitely can't open any of the cupboards, any of the drawers. No. Ooh. I might not be able to open the cupboards and the drawers, but someone can open the doors for me. Is that the doll, I wonder? Hmm. Right, through here? Okay. That's good, because I'm probably going to shit myself soon. Oh, hang on. Let's close this up. What are we going to find? Okay, toilet beer. Always good. Something down here? No, it's just a coat hanger. I saw the metal bit and I thought, key, maybe? But no. A few pencils. That's about it. Hmm. Right, this will be the front door. And it's still locked. I can't unlock it. Right. This way? Oh, right. Ah, okay. So, I've explored the ground floor pretty well. Let's head upstairs, shall we? Okay. Oh, there's the doll. <laughs> Looks like she's got something on her back. A piece of paper or something. Right, what about these? Don't use those, no. Can't get around that. Are you looking at me? Hmm, dunno. Yeah, I just get the idea that she's looking at me. Uh, let's see. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> this... Couldn't have been here to begin with. You wouldn't have been able to squeeze past. Definitely not anymore. Right. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, shit. Okay. Oh, that didn't look like a doll. Okay. Looks like a kid's bedroom here. Maybe the kid that I just saw. Nothing down there. Can't use the other two. Okay. Oh, what was this? 21. 21. Okay, that's got to be important. All right. 21. Maybe that's going to be a 
a date, the 21st of some month. Okay, that's locked from the other side. What about this one? Okay, again, to another bedroom. Nothing down here? No, I don't think so. <laughs> another kid's bedroom by the looks of it. Let's see. No, okay. Oh, oh! 65 now. Okay, I don't think it's going to be a date. 2165? I'm just going to make a note of this. 2165, okay. A hairbrush as well. Hmm. Maybe it's going to be a combination for a safe or something like that, but I haven't found one. Uh, maybe it's going to be for something downstairs or... Not really sure. Right, let's just check everything over again, just in case something's changed. Like, this has been moved out of the way, for instance. There you go. Right, what about the doll? Is she... Right, she is looking at me, isn't she? <laughs> She's turning when I turn. I see. Right, okay, through here? Alright. Alright, so what have we got here? Doesn't really look like a... A family bathroom or anything quite like that. Oh, <laughs> just for a second, I thought that might be marked, but no, I, I don't think so. Hmm, it stinks. Well, he did say it was going to be smelly. I can't believe it actually worked. I did it, but something feels not right. I can tell by the look on their face. They're not the same. They're not the same. Okay. Hmm. Alright, we've got another bedroom here. I don't know what happened to the family that used to live here, but I... Well, based on what I'm seeing, I guess they died a horrible, horrible death. Maybe the doll had something to do with it. The code, two digits from his room, two digits from her room. And then one digit from her doll. Right. She must have a page. She must have a, a, a number on her back. Just need to get to it, I suppose. Alright. Okay. Yeah, we've just gone around in a circle, haven't we? Fair enough. Okay, I'm going to go back through here. Check the other side of the room out, just in case. You weren't there before, were you? No, you weren't. This is pretty unsettling. Yeah. This isn't bad. Not bad at all. Right. There's got to be a way I can get to you. Okay, uh, maybe I can leap over on this side and grab you, or... Oh, I don't know. Right. Actually, if it works in the way I think it does... Yeah, hang on, hang on. Yeah, that's right, that's right. Seven! It's a seven! Just gotta keep my eye on you. Or you'll do that. Okay, so 21, 65, and 7. Potentially in that order. Okay. Still don't really know where to use that, but somewhere around here. Okay, I think I might know where to use it. <laughs> on the other side of this blockage, of course. Uh, okay, All right, this is going to be a little bit fiddly, but right. So, 21, there you go, and then 65. And 7. Hey, there you go, I unlocked it. And there's blood seeping out from underneath the door. Okay. Are we following the blood again? Hmm. I do like the, uh, the low level of audio in this game. It's there, it's always there, but it's really quite quiet. Bit of a weird way to go around, but okay. What was that? Did I just get an examine? I, I thought I just saw a prompt, but now I can't find where I got it. Hmm. Okay. Time to die. Yeah, I think I've seen that book cover a few times now. Oh god. 
Right. There's quite a few of you, aren't there? Hmm. Wait, so... Di oh. <laughs> oh, shit. They all turned to face me as well. Oh, boy. Okay, right. Let's just ignore them. What we got? Help? You want me to help? How? Oh, hang on. A key! It's the basement key! Right. I feel like someone's watching me all the time, and I can't shake that. I'm having trouble concentrating on my book. I hear footsteps chasing me, but when I look back... Run. Run. Oh dear. Okay, run. Why? Why should I run? Why does this feel like a horrible trick? Still, I'm gonna do it, just in case. Right. Okay. Just heading back to the basement, right? Oh, <laughs> trying not to knock myself out on the door. Okay, this way. Okay. I did hear something. I still hear something, right. Uh, back this way. Oh, okay, right. Oh. Oh, right. Okay. Now I know what I'm running from. <laughs> okay. So, hold on. When I... When I turn, much like the doll, she stops as well. Okay, shit. Run, 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 run. This is a little bit unsettling, honestly. Okay, come on, come on. Ooh. Right, close the door. Hopefully she can't open them. Right, down here, come on. And the basement key. Okay. Thankfully it's part of a new area. She was hot on my tail. And yes, I do need to get out of here. Why are you only now having that thought? Lock from the other side. Okay. I guess she's not going to follow me through. So right, those notes that I've been seeing, like what, did the... The guy tried to bring back his dead kids as dolls and it went wrong or something, and they weren't quite right. Another mannequin, another mannequin, right. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, I'm gonna need another key, probably. Yeah, that doesn't fit the lock. Do you have the... <laughs> I was gonna ask, do you have the key? Ah, uh, right. Okay, that's a theme in the game. Things looking at you when you're not looking. Uh, this way then? Oh man. Ooh! Ah. That'll be the other kid, brought back from the dead, presumably. They always appear with a trail of blood. Ah, hang on. Uh, well, that's not gonna work either, is it? No, I need a tool to open it, I probably need to cut that chain. Hmm. This way, then? Okay. Okay, so we're looking for a key, we're looking for a tool. Or if I get a good pair of bolt cutters, to be honest, maybe I could just snap through them both. He's always afraid of the dark, and when he was scared, he would come to me. But now he never leaves the darkness. Is that because you keep him down in the basement? Hmm. Oh shit. Okay, that again has a chain on it. Uh, that's not going to work. I need to find this tool. Around here? Okay. Bit of a dead end, really. Oh, hang on. Oh, ha they look like, uh, they look like handles for bolt cutters or something like that. Can I get around? Did I miss them? Ah, uh, here we go. I didn't see these. Right, bolt cutters. Yeah, a tool to cut chains. Right, well, uh, there's a couple. Let's choose this one first. Yeah, nice. Is this where I started? I think this is where I started, right? That was, yeah, yeah, that was locked from the other side. Okay, yes. I know where I am. So, what I want to do, I suppose, is go this way? Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. Let's open this up. Okay, new area. Alright. 
small little pocket of a room. Nothing down there? No? Okay. Try as I might, the other drawers just never seem to work. Oh boy. I've had enough of basements, honestly, especially after Madison. <laughs> oh, hello. Right, guess I can't go that way. This way, then? No blood stain. That's good. I haven't seen him or her. I don't hear them either. Okay, around here. The basement's a little bit of a convoluted maze, isn't it? Some of the upstairs was the same. Got another drawer? Nothing in this one. Right. I want to find more notes. I want to find more backstory. I want to know what the hell's going on here, really. Alright. Through here? Let's see. No, again. Not going to happen. Presumably soon, I'm going to find the key for the, the padlock? Maybe I've missed it, I don't know. Ah, here we go. Okay. Th that's it, it's the padlock key. And there's something else too. I know I need to put an end to this. I can't keep hoping they'll change. I need to accept what I've been given and move on with it. But I can't. I just can't. I, I can't. Right. That's it, that's it. Okay. Well, I've got the padlock key, so I suppose I just need to get out of here, don't I? Oh. Hello. Right. Is there somewhere else I can... Oh, God. Okay, yeah. Maybe there's somewhere else I can go, or I can lure him round to this side of the TV. There you go. Oh. Oh, fuck it. Who the... F right. Oh, I did not like that at all. Oh, that was fucking sketchy as shit. Right, okay, someone turned... Ah! Someone turned my flashlight off. He lives in the darkness, doesn't he? I think I need my flashlight. Fucking hell. Right. He's chasing me. He's- Fuck! He's chasing me! Right. Stay in the light. Ah! Fuck! Okay, right, right. Oh, this is a problem. This is a problem. This way. Oh, shit! Okay. No. Uh, I'm dead. He caught me. I don't know if he got me through the wall there, or he just ran around quick enough, but right. Let's try that again. Okay, and around I go. Keeping an eye on him as best I can. Now I know that the mannequin is in the way. So, yeah. I know which way I'm not going to go. Okay. Come on, come on. Shit, okay. Gotta go this way. Gotta go around. And then around here, okay. I think I've got a pretty good lead on him at the moment. Uh, okay, hang on. Yep. Okay, let me the hell out of here. Uh, right. So, we're back in the main basement bit, I think? I'm not sure. So, the padlock key, there you go. There's two ways down to the basement? Hmm. I didn't see another way up into the into the house. Oh. All right. Oh, we're in a shed. Oh, there was a shed nearby, wasn't there? Right. Okay. So, how do we? Oh, right. Hang on. Uh, use the bolt cutters again. I unlocked it. Hey. Right. So, I went in, I explored, I didn't steal anything, I, I found a couple of ghost children, a few dolls that were moving around, didn't find my friend, but at this point, sod him, right? I don't think he deserves to be found. He got me into that shitty situation in the first place. Exactly. I'm sorry, Mark. I tried, I really did, but I didn't stumble over your corpse anywhere. Looks a lot nicer in the daytime. Yeah. And there you go, ending- oh, ending A. Oh, okay. Looks like I found all the notes, but ending A. So there's an ending B? Would that be the bad ending? Because it seems like ending A was a fairly good one. I mean, I made it out of there alive, I escaped. Not so sure about Mark. 
To be honest, I never saw any trace of him. I don't know if he was ever really there. Maybe he just parked his car and went in another direction. Maybe there was another abandoned house that he was exploring and I just went to the wrong one. Who knows? But yeah, I think I got the better of the two endings with this playthrough. Thank you for playing. Well, thank you for watching. Leave your thoughts down below in the comments. Let me know what you thought about this game. What did you think about Dollhouse? I thought this was pretty good. Oh, not perfect, not bad, um, kind of, you know, sort of in the middle somewhere. But yeah, it was quite creepy, quite effective, quite unnerving when it wanted to be, especially when the kids were following you. Uh, I liked the way it looked, I liked the way it sounded, with the very slight, subtle audio cues, the pitter-patter of footsteps as they were chasing you, for instance. Uh, and I quite liked the fact that things moved when you weren't looking, uh, whether it be the dolls, the mannequins, some of the furniture getting in or out of the way. Yeah. Not a bad game. I enjoyed this one, and hopefully you did too. See you next time. Who wakes me up in the middle of the night? Only your friend with the best ideas, of course. I found an abandoned house in the woods. It's a bit smelly, but I'm sure it's not much fun either way. It's not really selling it to me, to be honest. Surely he'd be... That's gonna go down to the basement. I don't think I'm ready to die quite yet. Well, at least I haven't found his corpse yet, right? <laughs> Whoa. Definitely can't open any of the cupboards, any of the drawers. No. Ooh. Right. Okay. Ooh. Right. She is looking at me, isn't she? <laughs> when I look back... Run. Okay. Ooh. Right. Is there somewhere else I can- Oh god, okay. There you go. Oh. Oh fuck it. Who the f- Right. Oh, I did not like that at all. I'm sorry, Mark. I tried. I really did. But I didn't stumble over your corpse anywhere.